Hey, what's up? This is my official Colomix X06 mixer review. You're gonna to wanna to hang around to the end of this video because we're gonna give this one away. But um, first things first, we did 12,000 square feet of metallic epoxy with just this one mixer. So check this out. This is our new mixer from Colomix. And usually when we're mixing metallic powder, it takes like three or four minutes to get the powder blended in the bucket. They sent me this new paddle. I don't know why it does it, but I'll show you. It's pretty crazy because it used to take us like three to five minutes to mix metallic pigment in the epoxy. And now we're able to do it in like 30 seconds. It's great. The other thing we like about this mixer is that this stand kind of holds the drill steady so you actually don't have to fight the mixer at all, it just holds itself. Anyways, Colomix X06 RMX mixing stand. I forget the name of this paddle, but they told me it was made for epoxy. So the funniest thing happened when I posted a podcast about this project. Daryl, the guy who used to work for me, he actually texted me while he was watching the podcast. He was our main mixing man for a couple years, and um, he, made, like, he literally mixed every job for probably two or three years straight. And the one thing that he really hated was mixing metallic powder in epoxy. We used to use a battery powered drill with just a regular paddle and it just took forever. It was so slow we actually had to mix all of our metallic powder before we even started the job. And the clip I'm about to show you, we're doing a 1200 square foot garage and I knew it was gonna take five or six batches of epoxy. So Darrell would measure six batches ahead of time and he would dump metallic powder and then blend the powder in each batch before we started doing the job. That way there would be no lag in between mixes when we're actually pouring the floor. I went through some of my old footage and I found a clip where I recorded him pre-blending metallic powder one day and uh, it, was, it was like 80 degrees that day, it was super hot and he was out there just struggling blending that stuff and I set a GoPro up and recorded it so I'm gonna time lapse the GoPro footage of him mixing the powder. Uh, hold on. Oh. Sorry, Daryl, I didn't. If I had known that a different mixer would make that much of a difference, I would have gotten one a long time ago. Sorry. All joking aside though, the X06 was so good that Chris and Schaefer were actually able to blend the powder in the resin and mix the batch of epoxy. They were, they were able to do all of that and they were going faster than we were able to put the material down. So this new mixer made a huge difference on this job. And if you look at that clip I just played, Daryl actually had to sit the drill on a bucket in between batches. Like it took so long that he didn't want to just keep going. So he'd sit the drill down for a second and you know, just stand up for a minute. And, and the epoxy would just drain off of the paddle and it would just get all over the place. It was impossible to keep clean. We would track it all over the place. It was just, it's not a good situation. I mentioned earlier in the video that I really like the RMX mixing stand because it holds the mixer up for you. You really can't mix this stuff with one hand and even when you're mixing, you actually aren't even holding the mixer. You're really just holding the button down because the drill is doing all the work and the stand is holding it in place. It makes the whole process really easy. But a side benefit to using the stand is that when you aren't actually mixing, you can slide the drill over top of a trash bucket and all the excess epoxy just drips off, keeps the job site really neat. It's great. So when I decided to make this video, I reached out to Colomix and I told them that this was coming and they were kind enough to send me a brand new Colomix X06 mixer with the epoxy paddle to give away on this channel. It's really cool that Colomix is doing this for us. Um, they, I appreciate them supporting this channel and I'm pumped to be giving this away to one of you guys. It's really, really simple rules. All you have to do to enter a contest is leave a comment down below. You can actually enter this three times because this video is going to be posted on IGTV, LinkedIn, and YouTube. So if you comment in all three of those places, you get entered three times. And we'll announce the winner in two or three weeks. Not sure the exact timing of it, but within the next, 
we'll just say next month or so. Just make sure you follow along on LinkedIn, Instagram, and on YouTube, and we'll be announcing the winner soon. If you want more information about this mixer, all the information will be down below. Thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.